Okay, so today for language arts, we're going to be going over adjectives. Now, an adjective will tell all about a person, an animal, a thing, or a place. Now, I want you to think, what part of speech is a person, animal, place, or thing? A noun. So, an adjective is going to describe a noun. So, we're going to go through some examples. An adjective can answer the question, what kind? So if I read the sentence, the big horse galloping through the woods, well, let's say, let's change it to, I saw a big horse galloping through the woods. So now if I'm looking at it, I see horse and I can say, what kind of horse? It's a big horse. So an adjective is just going to add some description because if I just say, I saw a horse galloping through the woods. In your head, you could think of any horse, but at, now you know it is a big horse, so it makes the sentence more detailed. And horse is an animal, so it is a noun. All right, this is a huge farm. So now I'm looking, and huge describes what kind of farm. It's a huge farm, and farm is a place which makes it a noun. So my adjective is describing the noun. It's saying, what kind of noun is this? What kind of farm is this? It's huge. The small child is walking to school. All right, this sentence is about a child, but what kind of child? It's about a small child. So now we're describing what kind of noun I mean, we have a noun child, and we're saying what kind of child gives us small. So adjectives, you're going to ask multiple questions. So the first question we're going over is for an adjective, what kind? But some adjectives tell about the color or the shape. So if I said, did you see the yellow flowers? You could write down, oh, yes, I do see the what kind of flowers? the yellow flowers. You can also ask for what kind to go with colors and shapes. Also, if you have, again, for language arts, a piece of paper and a pencil, take notes. So that way, when you do your IXL homework, you can look back at your notes to help you through the lessons. All right, so now if I'm reading, I love red bell peppers. Hmm, what could be the adjective in this sentence? Well, what kind of bell peppers do you love? And we have red, which is giving us a color. And bell peppers are a noun because it is a food. It is a thing. All right, so number three. Can you grab my blue marker? So if I go over here to my marker. No, number one. So if I say this, it is a thing, so it is a noun. What kind of marker? It is a blue marker. It's describing the marker. All right, the round moon is in the sky. So now moon is my noun, and now round is describing the moon. I could have said a square moon, but that wouldn't be very accurate, right? Because the moon is just, it's a round, it's a circle. All right, number five, the pencils are in a square box. So I know box is my noun, but what kind of box? A square box. <sighs> All right, but some adjectives also tell about size, which we went over with our what kind, but we're just gonna go over. So we have what kind, when we ask that, it could be telling us about the color, it could be telling us about the shape, it could also be telling us about the size. So this is a small kitten is number one. So I know that our noun is kitten, but what kind of kitten? Now, what word is describing kitten? Small. It is a small kitten. So small is my adjective. That is a big building. I don't know why there's my bad. There shouldn't be an ex a question mark. It's not a question. It's a statement. That is a big building. So building is my noun. But what kind of building? Now we're talking about size. It is a Big building. So big will be my adjective to describe building. Number three. 
Have you seen the tiny paper clips? So paper clips is my noun, but what kind? What size are they? They're tiny. All right, so let's go over again. When I'm asking what kind, it can tell color, shape, and size, but it can also tell how many. So when we ask what kind, it goes over color, shapes, and size, but if I go ask the question how many, it's going over numbers. So I have two dogs. How many dogs? Two. So numbers are going to be also our adjectives. The classroom has 12 desks. How many? Remember, we're going how many desks? Desk is our noun. 12. So 12 is describing how many desks. So 12 is our adjective. I saw 10 birds flying. So now birds is our noun. It's an animal. Now, how many birds did you see flying? 10. So that is going to be our adjective describing how many birds you see. So our adjectives are going over describing something, a noun in the sentence. So it's describing what kind, how many, so, and it adds detail to our sentence. It makes our sentence more interesting. If I said, hand me that marker, but I needed a specific marker like the green marker, and you, you wouldn't know because we need to be detailed in our sentences and specific. So that's what adjectives are going to do. So for homework today, we're just going to go over some IXL standards, going over identifying adjectives. All right, and that is it for today. So have a great rest of your day. All right, thank you.